also following a developing story out of Upper Darby, where an early morning shooting spree left one person dead and injured another. Police say this all started just before 4 a.m. when the suspect was involved in a deadly domestic dispute. The suspect then ran into the street and began firing at random, eventually getting into a shootout with SEPTA police near 69th Street Station. Action News reporter Gray Hall is live at 69th and Market Streets with more on the wild scene that unfolded there this morning. Gray. Hey, Sarah, I can tell you this still very much an active scene. If you take a look behind me, you can see detectives still here processing the scene. Uh, just hours ago, bullets were flying, and when this was all over, police tell us one woman was dead. It's kind of sad and hurtful. She didn't deserve this at all. At all. Do you know like and we want justice those claiming to be family members of the victim who has not been identified are demanding justice. It, honestly, it didn't hit me yet, but I feel like it's going to hit me soon when I can't call her, can't text her. It was a chaotic and dangerous scene overnight near SEPTA 69th Street Transportation Center in Upper Darby. One unidentified man is now in custody after Upper Darby police say he murdered a woman, shot at someone passing by and then fired at SEPTA officers at 69th and Market. We're very fortunate at the time of day that it was that it was 3.30 in the morning and it wasn't you know, later in the morning because there's a lot more people that are in this area. Officers responded to the scene after the woman was shot and killed in a domestic incident inside 7022 Terminal Square. Investigators say the shooter ran from the apartment building and was firing his gun in the air. They say he eventually shot a random person on the street. He engaged a male who was down here on Market Street. He shot that male one time in the shoulder. That male, thankfully, non-life-threatening injuries was taken to a local hospital, and he is going to be okay. Police say the gunman saw those SEPTA officers right near the 69th Street Transportation Center, and that's when he fired at them. Those officers fired back, but the gunman was not hit. Officers chased him and eventually took him into custody. Luckily, thank God, those officers are all okay. We believe that this was a suicide by police. This gentleman came out of that apartment, and he was looking to be, be shot by police. All right, so back out live, if there is any good news in this story, again, it is that that suspect is in custody. Officers telling us this is still an active investigation. Live in Upper Darby, Gray Hall, Channel 6, Action News. Sarah?